won't last two seconds if he invades your mind. I'm not weak! Then prove it. If Voldemort's building up an army, then I want to fight. Whoa! That's your first look at Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. The fifth in the Harry Potter series, and Ben Lyons just went across the pond for your VIP tour of the set. We keep you busy, Ben. Yeah, working me hard. Nice to see you, Debbie. Hey. You know, that's right. I got the chance to hang out at Hogwarts, and I didn't learn how to cast a spell, but I did get a ton of on-set secrets straight from Harry himself. <laughs> You having a good time on the fifth one? Yeah, no, it's great. I mean, I've, I've had probably the most fun so far in Tom's Island. I suppose there's two main reasons for that. Partly it's because of working with um, Imelda, who plays Umbridge, and partly because of David, the director. And we've been shooting for about eight months. We've got some terrific stuff, some new worlds in this. In this movie, we come here to the Ministry of Magic, you know, which is a fantastic place. We go to Grimmauld Place. So it sort of opens up and expands the universe. Harry Potter! People die in the storm. They are getting dark, and I think that's that's good because if you think that all the people that watched the first one when they were 11 are now 17 or 18, you know, so they've grown up with with the films, and so they're they're ready for it to be dark. It's quite a political story. It's quite an emotional story, and Harry goes on a much more uh, nuanced journey. Lots of action, lots of adventure. All the characters we lo know and love. Oh. Oh. That felt good. Not good. Brilliant. Over the years, people like Emma Thompson, and I know you're a big Gary Oldman fan, and now Helena Bellum Carter is in yeah. the film. So what have you learned from some, some of these iconic actors and actresses who have been a part of the franchise? I mean, the, the two people that I've learned the most from, most definitely been, as you say, Gary Oldman and uh, Imelda. Gary's um, much more intense, or his intensity is much more out of the open than Imelda's. There was one moment in this film where I had to cry, and he came up to me, and he just grabbed me and shook me really hard. And as he backed away from me, I started crying. Of course, the big sport in the Harry Potter films is? Quidditch. How yes. is the game these days? Well, the, thankfully, I've not had to do it in this film. Um, it's all rusty. I, I don't particularly, Quidditch has never been the most fun to film. Why's that? Oh. Okay, Where's the broom? There you go. Yeah, where's the broom? We have two more to go. Are you starting to see the light at the end of the tunnel a little bit? I am. It's been an incredible journey. Well, I know I'm going to be very sad when it's all over. Expecto Patrona! Okay, admit it. Did you ask him to be in the next one? No, I don't know <laughs> if I could fit into a wizard's costume. And I got to be honest, I wasn't a huge fan of the franchise going into this whole thing. But after spending some time with the cast, I will forever be a fan of Harry Potter.